I'm in a comedy show with these two comedians. Um, this is their book they put out this year. It's called It's Tracy and Martina Hun, A Guide to Cape Breton Living. Um, and I'll leave a link to this book in the description box I'm trying to find. Look, there's a map of Cape Breton. It's a crib board. Um, anyway, so they have their own show on SwearNet. It's called Tracy and Martina Dirty Deeds. Being on the show has been an absolute dream of mine, like pipe dream come true. How I ended up on this show is a huge story. Again, I'm not an actor. I'm a YouTuber, and I ended up getting an acting role in the show, and I play um, Martina's daughter. I'm going to show you some clips from, from behind the scenes in a minute. They needed a baby in the show this year to play my cousin's son, Claxton. So Hank is in it, and Hank plays Claxton, Logan, Michael. He looks ridiculous. I got him like like a hilarious like faux hawk with kind of like a mullet haircut and it's his christening is <laughs> is the episode that he's in it was like really hard to get the shots because um he's two and a half and he's like a little wrecking ball so it was tough to get the shots but i think we got them anyway when i showed up on set this year like compared to last year you could just tell everything was more professional there was like we definitely have a bigger budget i don't know anything about that but just like the set person was insanely talented. The scripts were like so well written. There was just better lighting, better hair, better makeup, better wardrobe, better everything. The wardrobe person, Trish, you're never gonna watch these videos. I'm obsessed with you. The cast, everybody on the crew, it is literally like a dream come true. Like me, Susie, nurse from Cape Breton gets to be on a comedy show. I get to be on like a real series. And yes, right now it's only available on SwearNet, which is the Trailer Park Boys Network. But I feel like it's going somewhere. There's so many like special guests and like there's a couple of TikTokers in the show this year that you might recognize. It's just, it's so funny. It's got everything. It's got Cape Breton, Curly Susie, Curse Words, and Drag Queens and comedy like it's it's good anyway so my character's name is brandy lynn here's my hair i was talking about wearing a wig for like a bunch of days so here's my wig i got this wig on amazon and i'm going to show you the clips of the show in a minute and it was really good quality for like 30 some dollars um and it came with wig caps and pins and it really it has like these little clips in the back to secure it to your head it was great it really transformed how i looked You should see my bedroom. Like the set of my bedroom in the show was amazing. Like right down to like a Ziploc bag full of old Easter candy and an ashtray with cigarette butts and like little butts like on my nightstand. Just clothes and underwear everywhere. Plates with like chicken fingers on them and ketchup smeared on. Ugh. It was, ugh. it was. <laughs> It was hard to shoot. So that's about all that has been going on with me in my life. And I hope you found this video at least entertaining. Um, I'm going to be posting hair content and more like health and fitness related content in the near future. When the show comes out, I will um, send all the information so that you can watch it if you're interested. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you did not like it, give it a big old thumbs down. If you're kind of like in the middle about it, do nothing. Subscribe to my channel and I will see you very soon in my next video.